okay, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a home, this ain't a phone. Grind never stop and I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the home. What's up, y'all? It's Elena, and I'm going to be reacting to It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Season 5, Episode 8. Last episode, the gang wrestled for the troops. I was told that Roddy Piper was the maniac, and I had a feeling I knew who he was because he looked so familiar. But someone told me, yeah, he played in um, They Lived, and I was like, oh my gosh, I love that movie. It's not too much of a movie. It's more of a documentary, but I'm not going to say too much on that. I'm going to leave that alone because I ain't trying to get got. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, they wrestled for the troops, and... Frank killed Cricket. Well, I thought he killed Cricket, but someone told me that Cricket's alive. So, yeah, Cricket's still alive. But he got his neck slit. Like, and hella blood was all over the rings. So I don't know how he's still alive. Well, shout out Cricket. We're going to see him in more episodes. While that was going on, D met the soldier who came in town. And he came in on the wheelchair, and D did not like it. She ran away from him and passed him on to Artemis. But then D realized that he could walk, and he didn't really need the wheelchair. And D wanted him back, but Artemis wasn't having it, and Cricket definitely wasn't having it. But, um, yeah, we're gonna get into this episode, though. If you want to see my full reaction to this episode, check out my Patreon. The link is in the description below. Let's get into it. Hello, Charlie Kelly here. Local business owner and cat enthusiast. Is your cat making too much noise all the time? Is your cat constantly stomping around, driving you crazy? What is this? Is your cat clawing at your furniture? Think there's no answer? You're so stupid. There is kitten mittens. Oh. Finally, there's an elegant, comfortable mitten for cats. couldn't hear anything is your cat one-legged is your cat fat skinny or an in-between that oh doesn't gosh. matter because one size fits all kitten mittens you'll be smitten me <laughs> what the hell is this like why so, lately at night, I've been forced to fall asleep to the deafening sound of, like, a hundred alley cats tapping on my <laughs> windows trying to get in. What do moronic kittens <laughs> have to do with our bar? Okay, one, they're not moronic. They're awesome. They're and moronic. Two, uh, nothing. Look, Charlie, I kind of like this. I might Actually, it's not. You here. That's kind of cute. Idea. We could do t-shirts, we could do beach towels, those nudie pens. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're not going to make any money off this place. You don't own a piece of the bar. No, but I own 100% of the merchandising. It's in my contract. To be honest, I don't even remember signing any kind of contract. Oh, you don't remember? Did it slip your mind? That's okay, because it's right here. <laughs> I keep it in this drawer so that you two jerks don't try it. Hey, 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 wait, what are you doing? <laughs> you son of a bitch! Well, that doesn't nullify it, you know. Hey, uh, oh, why? Do you have another copy? I, I hope Max not eating it. Don't. I don't. <laughs> but you can't just go eat a contract. He just did eat it. Yeah. All right. You know, I'm talking to a lawyer about this. Maybe I should slap a patent on my kitten mittens before you guys try and steal that too, huh? I can see it in your eyes. You're all over this, aren't you? <laughs> you know, I gotta say, Mac, my instinct to steal this idea is very strong. Kitten mittens. No, idiot. Merchandising in the bar. Yeah, I'm thinking we take this merchandising convention as an opportunity to make merchandise for patties. Right. How about, like, uh, hard-boiled eggs from Patty's Bar? Green eggs, says Patty's on them. You keep them on your desk and when you go to work. Who's going to want to keep a hard-boiled egg on their desk at work? Oh, all right. Then you put it on your dashboard of your car. It's just a jumping-off point. Frank, keeping hard-boiled eggs on your desktop or the dashboard of your car is not a jumping-off point. Well, you get the hell out of here. Right? <laughs> For real, that's a terrible-ass <laughs> idea. idea. Clearly, you don't get it, so I don't want I don't to get it. You don't. You don't get it. I don't get it. You don't get oh, it. Oh, yeah. We'll see who doesn't get okay. it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Hard-boiled eggs. Oh, like, what? Not a bit. Like a stone cold bitch, and you know it. And he knows it because he turns the picture away from him. Uh, well, that girl's gorgeous. Uh -oh. She does look a little mean, though. <laughs> we just There's the, man. the old fashioned way with doors and feet and walking. You are aware that there are other lawyers in Philadelphia. Uh, but you know, the three of us have a history. Sure. We uh, we have a we have a past. 
mm -hmm. if you will. Mm -hmm. And Charlie and I really like the fact that you don't charge. I do charge. Okay, you don't pay. We're both men of the law, you know? We get after it, you know? We jab our jaw, we go tit for tat, we have our little differences, but at the end of the day, you win some, I win some, and there's a mutual respect left over between no, us. Uh, any respect that you're feeling that's coming from me is a mistake on your part. <laughs> then I'll just regress, because I feel like I made myself perfectly redundant. Does a legal document hold up in a court of law if it has been ingested by the other party? I'm now, not. mind you, the heretofore document had had dry ink on it for at least many Look at the way he's holding uh, his shirt. <laughs> here to, we yeah, signed it a long time ago. It was a long time ago signed. I'm also going to need a patent for the kitten mittens. I'm sure you do. I was going to ask you. Hey, need <laughs> kitten mitten patents? That's or them. Something? I'm sorry, sir, but they locked me in a closet. Of course they did. Of course they did. So I think we need to be selling a certain attitude, right? One that reflects our take no prisoners rock and roll lifestyle. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Now what says that more than this? Oh huh? my gosh. Patty's thong, dude! Patty's thong! You're wearing women's underwear. <laughs> yeah, bro, you bet your ass I'm wearing women's underwear. Patty's thong is gonna be a huge hit with chicks. Why are you wearing it? Uh, question. Yeah, Mac, go. Dennis, are women gonna wanna buy their underpants in a bar? No, women will not buy their underwear in a bar, but men will buy the underwear for their women in the bar because it's not for women, it's for men. It's a visual stimulant, bro. I'm not wearing these because I'm comfortable. I'm wearing them because I want to turn you on. You know what I'm saying? You get it? Yeah, yeah bro. It's okay. a visual stimulation. Yeah, can I go now? Yeah, sure. Kind of yeah, go ahead, Matt. Go ahead. Because I don't know what the hell that was. What do people love go ahead. Else in the world? Uh, they love comedy. They do. They do. Everybody loves comedy, right? They do. Right. You can't just go throwing jokes around willy-nilly. Oh. So I did one of those. <laughs> You drew a men's buttocks on a towel. Yeah. You get out of the shower in the college dorm, they got the butt right now. I will buy that. Your buddies are laughing. <laughs> and, then, and then you give them one of these. Boom. <laughs> oh, that is big. That's a big monster dick. That's huge. That's the biggest dick you've ever seen. Yeah, that's right? really, that's not how you see yourself. Though. No, that's funny. That is funny. That's funny. That's hilarious. Yeah, laugh at that. That's just set up. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, it's a baby dick. Yeah. We're gonna sell a million of these. We are gonna sell a million of we'll those. We'll do black dude. ones and yellow ones for the Asians. Yeah, that's this is probably more cool. Asian than wow. anything else. Yeah, oh my gosh. Maybe a little bit more bush. Well, you know what we should do? We should set up a website for it. <laughs> Already did it. What, you did? Dicktowel.com. <laughs> Dicktowel.com. <laughs> well, you yeah. don't think I know what's going on? Oh, huh? Jesus Christ. I don't get it. Huh? <laughs> Open your mouth. <laughs> Prepare to be blasted, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Brenda. <laughs> what the hell's going on? This is my new merchandising idea. It's a gun that shoots liquor into your mouth. You threw tequila in my eye! Well, I haven't figured out how to get the tequila to come out of the barrel of the gun. Well, what the but hell does she have to do with anything? Gosh. Check her out. I mean, she's gorgeous. You bring a woman with cans like that into the convention, you sell the idea in a second. So this is your plan? You're gonna go into the convention <laughs> waving a gun in people's faces, throwing tequila in everybody's eyes with a big-titted woman? Duh, yeah. Frank, get the hell out of here. Your ideas are ridiculous. Okay, okay. Suck on this, bitches. Eh? Eh, Patty's a pub. A stress ball. You squeeze it when you have any tension. Right. Oh, God damn it, Frank. That's just an egg. It's a jumping off point. Get out. Oh, my right. gosh. Just get the hell out of here. Well, don't even listen to that. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, we're stealing that gunshot idea, right? Gunshot idea is awesome. Oh, my God. What? The woman in the room right next to him? She just ate an entire sleeve of Chips Ahoy. Charlie, <laughs> could you focus on the lawyer's room, please? We're not here to blackmail a lady for eating too many cookies. Did you say an entire sleeve? An entire oh, that's sleeve. a lot. That's a lot of, of cookies. Of course, she's a humongous lady. What yeah, of course. Oh, oh shit. I see him. He's walking towards the car. He's walking towards the car. Get yeah, down. yeah, just, just, just duck. <laughs> what are you people doing in my car now? Okay, let me what? Explain. That's his car? We were staking you out last night, kind of spying on you. Yeah. It got a little cold to drop down, wasn't right? It? Did you feel so that? we Jimmy you lock and we kind of spent the night in here. Okay, yeah. uh, so why were you spying on me all night? Because you're having an affair and we're going to blackmail you for your services. Why does it look like you've been crying all night? I'll tell you what I think. I think you feel guilty. All right, listen. If he might be having a, um, getting a divorce. My wife is leaving me. Yeah. And I have to sleep in this flea bag motel. That's sad. Aww. Okay, that's our bad. That, it we, all uh, comes together. That makes a lot of sense. In a different glad. way than I thought. So, so um, do you want to have a conversation about helping us out with our kitten mitten patent? Yeah, and, I you know what? This contract. If um, 
Why don't you get out of my car? Yeah, get get the hell out. Get, get out of my car. I've had a hard yeah. couple of days. Yeah. The nerve. Okay, consumer, are you ready to get blasted in the mouth by Patty Shotgun? One, two, three. God damn it, dude. You just cannot blast water out of a gun. The technology is just not there. No, I mean, they did sort of figure it out with water guns, so I don't know why. Yeah, we... but water gun doesn't have the same feel to it. You know? I was like, you want to feel the weight of a real gun in your mouth. You want to taste the metal. You want to mm -hmm. feel the steel, man, yeah. you know? Okay, why? well, a new plan. Yeah. Let's just make a video. Show that at the convention. Not like Charlie's video, though. Ours needs to be cool. No, 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 dude. Way cooler than Charlie's. Yeah, yeah. With, like, quick cuts and awesome music mm -hmm. and eagles flying through the air. and picking up... What is up with y'all and eagles? Rip it apart and eating it. <laughs> All right. I did a little tweaking and <laughs> what is that? Patty shotgun, bro. You get blasted in the mouth. Yeah. We're also going to get a bust of your chick. Mm -hmm. uh, no offense, ma'am. You're very busty. Your breasts are very large, but uh, we want to go weird with it. We want to get really freakish. Um, <laughs> I would like to get your number, actually. Uh, no, we'll though, get the number. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look, yeah. you can't just take <laughs> somebody's idea, change the name of it, and then sell it. That's the American way, bro. Yeah. Screw you. Kiss it. <laughs> Kiss it. Hey, we got you a little something to take your mind off your current wife situation, Sandy. Have a seat right I know her. Where do I know her from? And everything's been taken mm -hmm. care of financially. She's okay. been briefed on the divorce. She knows all about knows everything all about that's going on. And, you know, because oh, my gosh. Where do I know her from? Yeah, I'll tell you what, buddy. I can help you out. I'm going to toss a frame bang your way. Now, here's how that works. I slip into your house one night while your wife is sleeping, and I ease into her real nice. And that way, you're both cheating on each other, and she can't clean you out. That's a win-win. Goddamn shoes. We'll take care of all of your legal needs if each of you agrees to never seek my legal advice again. Objection. This is not a court of law. Sustain. Frank, move to strike. They stole my idea. No, Open we... your mouth. Oh, 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 thanks, dude. Oh, 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 much propulsion I, on the gun i made tequila bullets but i guess i put too much gunpowder in new deal Ooh. we are taking that propulsion <laughs> putting it in our shotgun you made tequila no, no, no. bullets we sucks. we're all on the same team what okay i yeah. like that idea yeah. like all right that. tequila bullets right to the cat gloves <laughs> mittens dude pay attention oh sorry sir they duct taped me to the bathroom sink of course they did i don't know of course they did <laughs> Next up, we have submission 35, a potential investment opportunity in merchandising for a, uh, a Patty's Pub. Yeah. You're, you're really sweating. Well, my right eyes now, are really you're burning. Really you're really sweating. 30. <laughs> yeah, it's good. <laughs> Action, Frank. Go, Frank, now, go. Frank, just do the, do the Say the line now. Let me have a drink. How about a shot? What the? <laughs> oh my gosh. Patty's Pub, home of the original shotgun, and gun shot. <laughs> you shooting me? Shoot the girls, shoot the girls. Do shots as they were intended. <laughs> bro, turn this shit off, bro. <laughs> Dicktown.com. Now that's a great product. Nudie pen. Egg. So come on, dude. Invest Egg. in merchandise <laughs> and get blasted. <laughs> so y'all never deleted the footage, okay. huh? Y'all kept the footage all the, after all these years. This did not look cool. No. Uh, well, we had to admit, <laughs> terrible. You know, I mean, yeah. we just didn't have time. God, that was terrible. Does was your terrible. cat walk around too much? Does your cat make too much noise? Guess who just found some investors for kitten mittens? I told you, people love. Shit. Why do you keep calling it stupid, it's though? Really Why stupid, do you keep calling but people it stupid? are stupid, too, so... How much money am I gonna make? Do what now? Oh, the contract that you all blindly sign grants me 100% of the profits from any merchandising opportunities from your little bar and kitten mittens. I own that. Dude. I Man. had to get paid by you people somehow. Well, that's what the hooker was for. Dude! All right, touche. You outlawyer me there. Okay, <laughs> tell you the contract that you all signed also included a restraining order, <laughs> which you're all currently violating. Uh, excuse me, sir. Can I see these supposed documents that you have? Why, yes. Um, in fact, I happen to have that right here. Ah! 
He's a lawyer, Mac. I know he has copies. <laughs> yeah, you know, fortunately, I made hundreds of copies of that. <laughs> so, uh, why don't y'all have just a nice day? <laughs> and that's what y'all get. For stressing that man out. You can probably stop. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, are the people still in there? Just watching that? <laughs> Let's have a moment of silence for Ernie. Rest in peace. I'm not gonna lie. Some of those products were actually pretty good. Like um, the kitten mittens. That is so cute. And Max towel. That was a good idea too. <laughs> when Mac put the towel on and that little ass was on his ass. That was funny. That was real funny. Um, the whole fong thing Dennis was doing, terrible idea. Terrible. The gun that shoots out tequila, terrible. Funny, but terrible. And this man, Frank, made tequila bullets. How? How do you make tequila bullets? Do you just did he just dip the bullets in tequila and then just loaded the gun? Like, how do you even make that? Like, I I don't I don't that's I just don't get it. Um, and then not only that, they keep messing with this lawyer. And I really don't believe that they give a fuck about that restraining order. I know they don't care about that restraining order. They're probably going to see him tomorrow. A thought just came in my head. Maybe they violate the restraining order and the lawyer gets them put in prison because of it. Because they violated it. Maybe that's how we finally are going to get a gang goes to jail episode all i know is i know they don't give a damn about their restraining order <laughs> they gonna mess with the lawyer again but maybe the lawyer won't come back i hope he does though i really like that lawyer that lawyer is funny to me and i know when mac ate that contract he thought he did something i was like he is a lawyer i know he got like thousands of copies <laughs> like i know he got more copies than that he is dumb especially after finding out that you ate the last contract i know he's not that dumb to make just one copy of this contract. And if he did, he is the dumbest lawyer in the world. The dumbest. But um, yeah, yeah. This episode was so funny. So funny. But if you want to see my full reaction to this episode, check out my Patreon. The link is in the description below. Thank y'all for watching and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Hey, hey, okay, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a phone. Grind never stopping, I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the